Hello and welcome to the Fall of Gondolin. I said I was going to do it, uh, and that's exactly what I'm doing. I've even changed my skin for this special occasion. Look at that. It's it's me, but a ranger. Uh, the Fall of Gondolin is a map. I can't remember who it's made by, but I'll find out and put it in the description. Um, it's just it's amazing. It's huge. It's it's just a masterpiece. Uh, so. Yeah, let's get on with the adventure. Uh, it says, read note 1. I have a series of notes. 18, in fact. Uh, so I'm just going to take all of this stuff. Here. There you go. And I'm going to read the first note. Your name is Alcarian, son of Isilthor, an elf that hails from the hidden city of Gondolin. It has been many months since King Turgon sent you forth from the city to gather news from the far realms and seek rumours of the Dark Lord Morgoth's schemes. You have travelled far and are finally nearing the foot of the mountains that surround your secret home. After gathering up what supplies you have left, you look out outside and see the familiar dry riverbed that leads northward towards the hidden way through the mountains. Uh, okay, so we've read that. Uh, is it it's not near night, is it? No, we're good. Okay. Uh, I guess we go. I've got my stuff. Let's just get straight to it. Uh, there's a series of, like, um, treasure chests along this. Uh, sort of like Easter egg um, things. You can just collect them. Uh, and I think your score at the end uh, will add up. So this is the dry riverbed. I'm not allowed to place blocks, apparently. Uh, according to the rules. I'm also not allowed to break blocks uh, except for spawners and beds. Um, so yeah, let's get straight to it. And I saw this uh, and I assume there's going to be something up here hopefully. Is there anything up here? Secret chest number one. So diamond cooked pork chop and three arrows. Okay, that's a good haul for the first secret chest. Um, okay. Down? Okay, if we're down. The other way. Okay. What was that? I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Um, okay, let's keep going. Along the dry river bed. Uh, this is... I, I cannot explain to you how amazing I think this map is. There's another chest down there. Super chest number two. Another diamond in it. Uh, the only things I'm allowed to craft are swords and armor. Um, so, yeah. That's pretty much it. That's all I have to say at the moment. Okay, let's just follow the dry riverbed to the secret way through the mountains. Um, uh, this, this map is absolutely huge, and this... Uh, well, I played this with Harrison last year, um, and it literally took me, or well, it took us, two or three hours, to, yeah, two or three hours to do. So, um, if this, like, goes on for a while, I'm sorry, but it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, this is the custom texture pack that they made, um, Minecraft Middle Earth made. Uh, Okay, to complement the map, uh, any other texture pack just doesn't work. It just looks awful. So, um, these spawners are here, and I think they're meant to be spawning things. Oh, they have spawned something. Okay. Okay, I'm fine. I've escaped. Now, to get through the secret way, through the mountains. Right. Okay. Some signs. I I would like to say I although I have played this map before, I cannot remember anything about it. It was I literally did it. I when did I play this? Probably late 2012. So I really can't remember. Change difficulty to peaceful. Peaceful. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Through. Here we go. Looking good so far. Oh, I don't know why I'm um, hesitating. There's not any monsters here. Although I don't want to miss anything. 
I don't want to miss any chests or anything like that. Throwing chests in here, in this pool, um, behind the waterfall. No? Okay. Um, I don't know if I'm allowed to use these diamonds that I've collected to make a sword. It says I can make swords. So, I don't see why I wouldn't be able to. Chest anywhere? No. Okay, I can see uh, a barricade of some sort, or I don't know how to describe that. It's like um, a portcullis. There's a portcullis ahead with a door. Okay. Read note two. I would freeze where you stand, elf, unless you fancy an arrow between the eyes. You're Elkarian, you say. Well, I call you a liar. If you are he, then you are long overdue. Too long, I say. Hand your blade into the guard, through the hole in the gate, and then you may proceed. Uh, Echelion will know what to do with you. I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't practice the pronunciation of Elkarion. Uh, so chest back here? No. Okay. I am going to spend some of this looking for chests, by the way. So I need to hand my thing in. Here. Oh, okay, that worked. Awesome. We're through. Do I get it back? No, it's down there. Okay. Is there anything at the top of these? Okay, I don't think that does anything. Uh, anything up here? Another chest. With some foodies. At least I still have my bow, so I'm not completely disarmed. Okay, let's continue. Continue forward. So the guard doesn't think I am who I say I am. Uh, and I say I am Elkarian. Okay. Let's just make our way through. It hasn't said to change my difficulty back yet. I don't think. Uh, did it? No, I don't think so. Okay. I love this texture pack. It really does. Um, it really, it really is nice. Look like the string coming down. Uh, it's obviously done with string, and the torches changed into like lamps, and it's just great. Ah, this is note three. Oh, look, look at these torches. Uh, read note three. Elencia lumem omentielvo. Or oh, in English, a star shines on an hour of meeting. I know you all too well, Elkarian. You need not fear any longer. Turgon made me aware of your mission and told me to expect your return, although you have arrived quite later than predicted. But nonetheless, I sense no treachery in you, and I know that you will sooner die than expose our city to Morgoth. You have my blessing to pass through the city unhindered. Turgon will be most pleased of your return, and I expect you want to report uh, you want to report to him immediately. Take this map before you go. You've been gone quite some months, and I know you never, you're never good at finding where around the city. Uh, so I have been given uh, a map. I, there is a map uh, that I have in front of me. Um, that was made. I can't remember who by again. I'm terribly sorry. Uh, I'll put it on the screen uh, as I walk down here. Um, yeah. So as you can see, it, it is very well made. Uh, it's a very well made map. Um, took, I imagine it took a long time to make that. Cause it was, uh, it, yeah, it's very complicated. Uh, I don't understand any of it, and yeah, but still. So I'll make our way down. Ah, here we go. And this big long build up. Walking along here. Is there anything in these. Um, Gazebos? No? Okay, let's just keep going anyway. Is that the door, the entrance, I see? It is. We ha we're approaching Gondolin. Ah, here we go. Coming up the stairs of Gondolin. I, d I don't know why I have these torches at the moment. 
this is going to take a while to get up here. He said that um, I wasn't under threat of anything, but why did he take my sword? Uh, oh, the, the different guy took my sword, but he could have given me my sword back. Um, but it's fine, I have 16 arrows in my bow. Ah, through the gates, into Gondolin. There's no chests around anywhere, are there? No? Okay, into Gondolin. Absolutely magnificent place. Look at this. Uh, I don't know exactly where I'm going, so I'm just going to go straight forward. Uh, there's no sort of directions given. I say go straight forward, I might. Is there anything in here I can use? No? Okay. Let's just keep going forward. Look at this. This is just amazing. All retextured. Uh, this map was made, I think, for like 1.1 or something, which was a while ago. Um, amazing trees and uh, and palace here. Um, is there anything around anywhere? Ah, golden apple. Okay. Is there anything on the other one? bottom like that one? No. Okay. Let's go. Let's go into the palace. Should you go around the sides? No, I'll just go straight down the I'll just go straight in here. Oh yeah, here we go, here's a chest. Read note four. Uh, ah, so you've returned. Welcome home, Elkarion, son of Isilthor. You have been deeply missed. I expect you have suffered many hardships and are tired from your journey, and so I would not even think of pressing you about what you have learned during your travels. Head upstairs to the third floor, floor and you'll find a room ready for you. Have your sword returned to your room, including various other supplies. When you feel you are arrested, would you please send Maeglin's, uh, head to Maeglin's house at the end of this, south end of the city to look for him there. I have matters to discuss with him. Okay, I'm never going to be able to find that house because this place is huge, but I will certainly try my best. So to head upstairs to the third floor and get some sleep, apparently. Um, not in here. <laughs> okay. Ah, that third floor's up here. Right. Uh, is this it? Checkpoint one. Okay. Ah, iron sword. Leather boots. Okay, sweet. And uh, there's another room here. Anything in these chests? No, they're just there for decoration. Secret chest number seven. I have missed a lot of secret chests. Okay, let's go to sleep. Just to uh, save our checkpoint. Okay, morning has broken. I'm not going to jump out the window. Okay, let's head back down and find our way to Maeglin's house. Is that the same? Uh, yep, yeah, Maeglin's house at the south. Oh, okay, okay, at the south end of the city. Let's just eat a bit of breakfast and head on our way. Let's just swap them over. Right, south end of the city. Um, this way, I think. Maybe. Uh, I don't know where the. Um, let's go. Let's go this way. It may take me a while to find this. I'm terribly sorry for that. No, I have no idea. I'll find it, and uh, then. I'll be, I'll come back, okay? Right. Uh, but until then, uh, it's gonna ha I'm gonna have to bid you adieu. So, uh, bye. See ya.